the life of a footballer at Christmas time is very different to most people. While the majority of the population break up, let their hair down, have a good time, you guys are focused as much as ever on the job in hand. Yeah, we're stuck in work. Oh, wow, we don't get to enjoy it the same. So, is, there uh, any, is there any period of public holiday where we end up having to play more football matches? Yeah. Christmas Day, I think we get Christmas Day off. But Christmas apart from Day that, off. it's in as normal. And the big men's come. Santa up. comes down the chimney, yeah. so yeah, it's always... Get our presents and then, and then we're back in work again. It must be Christmas, he's had a little shave, he's had a haircut, he's looking good, isn't he? He's getting ready for Santa. He's looking very good indeed. Yeah, well, by fresh. the time this video Thanks goes coming. out, the big man, as you call him, will have come and gone. So, do you know what Santa is bringing Blaine Hudson this year? <laughs> I've sent my list off a couple of times because I've had to change it, but I'm not sure what's going to come down for me. I don't know, it could be anything. It could be anything. It's a lucky dip. How about you, Si? Um, I'm still waiting on uh, Blaine to change his mind. The last night would be the dog. Uh, he's still got it, but dog. we're, uh, You're not having my dog, we're holding on for a year. And then dog. I might have it. But no... Um, How many times do I have to tell you we're not going to talk about my dog? <laughs> Rev's asked you to do an interview. Go on then. Rev's asked you to do an interview in there. You didn't want to do it on your own. So you've said that I've got to do an interview. So now I'm sitting here with you. I weren't even involved in the interview in the first place. Yeah, but it's Christmas. And now we're both doing an interview. <laughs> but it's not Christmas by the time this video goes out. So that's sure. a bad excuse. And you've started talking about my dog. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want nothing then if I can't get it. No. You're not having my dog. All right. I'm and not having this dog yet. I don't want to talk about All my right. dog. No, so. my list's uh, quite short to be fair. Me and, uh, me and the wife. <laughs> Spend a little bit, but, but not too much. It's all about, it's, it's all about the kids, isn't it? When you got three kids and Santa, you know, he needs a little bit of money, so it's it's, it's hard to be fair. <laughs> so <laughs> she enjoys herself in uh, the January sales anyway, so we don't get enough for Christmas. The elves and, make the presents. Yeah, they don't yeah. Need money. And then Santa what goes. Do you need money for? The and then she money. goes wild in January <laughs> sales. What do you need money for? The elves make the presents. I know. Santa makes the presents and brings them to everyone. It's hard. Elves make the presents and Santa brings all the presents. What do you need money for? I don't know, it just disappears out of my bank for some reason. Does it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, bo funny. Boxing Day, of course, is a big day in the footballing calendar. Now, Simon, you've been at the New Saints for a number of years. Blaine, you've been at other clubs prior to joining Excellent. TNS. So, <laughs> for both of you, obviously, Blaine, particularly from a, a wider perspective, what games stand out for you, perhaps Chester or Wrexham? None of them. Always Wrexham for Blaine. Cold, muddy pitches when you have to Me and Blaine are still uh, big Wrexham fans. I think um, probably Boxing Day last year. Something happened last year on Boxing Day. I'm not sure what happened. Oh. Can you remember what happened? Boxing Day last year, Drake's got sent off. We played someone away. Did he? Yeah, oh, totally. Newtown, wasn't it? Yeah, oh, yeah. Newtown away, was it? Yeah, I remember that now. And there was quite oh. a good goal scored there as oh, well. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Now it comes back. Now it comes back. I totally forgot about that goal, you know, until you just brought it up, Rev. So thanks for bringing that to my attention. What a strike that was, Simon. Yeah, true that. Under the cosh as well. 2-1 down, were we? I'm not going to lie, Rev. He's done, he's done a few of them and they never, ever come close. Do you know one of those fluke ones where you just smash it and then you think, oh, my God, he's finally done it? 2-1 oh, down, yeah. Drapes has been sent off. Yeah, I remember that one, it was very good. Oh my goodness me, I'm so happy. He shows out, he doesn't score that many with his feet. So when he does, it has to hey, come I out. I scored more it? with my feet last year. No, no, no. Mm -hmm. yeah, he, he scored, scored one head nose. last year. He scored with his nose against mm -hmm. Balotelli. Most yeah. of them come off his nose, to be honest. <laughs> I've already scored three league goals with my head this year. That's more, true, more true. headers than I scored last year. Yeah. And I scored another one in Europe, I think it's the winner, I'm not sure. No feet, no feet, just head it. But yeah, what, um, what about you, Simon, on Boxing Day? Other than watching my goals fly into the top corner. No, it's, it's just the same. They all roll into one, don't they? You forget how many games you've played. You do, mate, you do. Because you're in, everyone else is enjoying themselves, and you've got your family, and they're all coming round. and they're all their turkey. And they're all drinking, they're on the Baileys. Yeah, Baileys, the, reheating oh. their turkey, sausage rolls, pigs in blankets, warm them up. And I'm sat there with a, with a Coke sticks. and uh, uh. a little bit of turkey, but that's it. Yeah, so everyone's having a good time. You can't have any. And then you get back. Everyone's a few deep, aren't mm. they? You get back Boxing Day. Everyone's I think that's the worst. Festive. That's the worst thing about it when you see everyone enjoying themselves and you know they're all having a few drinks and you know you can't. But it's one of those things, isn't it? Could be worse, it's worth Simon. it during the rest of the year when you're in work and you're doing what you love. So 
And what about games for you, Simon? What stands out? Apart from Blaine's goal last year at Newtown, what stands out for you with the new Saints on Boxing Day? Don't um, have to mention my goal if you don't want to. So just think of something. Oh, I, wouldn't, my, I, I know you're thinking about my goal, so I just wouldn't. think of something completely different other than my wonder strike. I don't know. It's, it's usually Newtown or Kevin Druids we play. Druids is better this year than Newtown. Druids, yeah. We played Druids. What was it last year? We played Druids. Newtown. It was, was it 2 2? Um, 2 2, yeah, on the Tuesday. Night. Good memory. See, so, yeah, yeah. So it's usually uh, Newtown or Druids we play, which is good because it's local. You can get home a bit earlier. But yeah, it's just. It's just a lot of games rolled into this time, so they all just roll into one and you just keep going and well, you have one or two days off and then you're back in playing again, so it's, it's very busy. And going into the festive period, the New Saints, five points behind <coughs> Connors Key Nomads. That's not familiar territory for TNS, certainly at this time of the year. So lots to play for. I'm looking forward to the, to the next few games, looking forward to the split. This gives us something to play for a bit, I think, five points behind. I don't, I, none of us are worried about it so um, looking forward to playing all those top teams again and taking the points back you're not worried are you Simon? I'm not worried Rev's not worried Sam's not worried the camera's not worried I'm just, I'm just worried, worried that Blaine's not training like usual he'll play a game <laughs> and then you don't see him till Friday and then he plays Saturday he's got into this luxury stage now where he doesn't train during the week he thinks he's one of the best players here now so he'll literally play Saturday and you don't see him till Friday he'll train Friday and he'll play on Saturday again whatever so works, he just Simon. needs to look after himself better. whatever works Simon yeah true if you don't train all week and then whereas score, I'm still working every day still score, trying my best you, so it's I'll, I'll always try my best they put the reins on me wrap me in cotton wool and then I'll he come. does he is wrapped in cotton wool at the moment because he scored a few headers they're uh, looking after him so don't worry about that Simon I'll be there Saturday but now uh, yeah it is different I mean, it's been you just four, five, six years, isn't it, since you we were knocked off at Christmas? But you just miss me. No, in we're not too far away. You miss me in the morning. I do so. miss him, to be honest. It's coffee me. club, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Instead of in the gym, aren't I getting massive? <laughs> yeah, I couldn't tell you how many coffees he has through the day. Do you know when you're meant to go in the gym and you do a session <laughs> and you look after yourself, and you can see him? He's sitting up here on the balcony and he's having a coffee watching his train when he's meant to be doing his work. It's and he wonder why he can't train through the rest of the week. That's a fib, that is. I'm working hard doing my rehab, so I'm ready for the weekend. You can you see him having see, a coffee. Just you don't see me out there, Simon. I see you up here, not me watching me, having a coffee. It, don't, it must be a lookalike. It's not a lookalike. Or oh, someone must have a mask of me on. I don't sit around drinking coffees all week. I work hard, Rev. Sam. Camera. I work hard. He's lying. If he worked hard, he'd be fit. He's lying. I am fit. Fit enough to play at the weekend. Score goals. My point exactly. Don't train, play games. So what's your problem? Taking it easy. It's better than training and not playing. No, yeah. it's not. Have you got a problem? Because if you have a problem, you have to take it up with the with the hierarchy. You have to no. go tell the boss downstairs because they're in charge. I'm just saying how pretty you look today. Oh, thanks, Simon. That's very kind. Next. 